23 ABC's digital update is brought to you by West Medical. Good evening, I'm Jessica Harrington. Here's what's making headlines around Kern County. Mayor Karen Go met with officials of Houchin Blood Bank to address the blood shortage during this pandemic. Go is calling on the community to help out. According to Houchin, numbers are down because of blood drive cancellations. Officials are urging the community to continue to donate blood. California State University Bakersfield is postponing its spring commencement. The university made the announcement earlier today. Officials say the CSU Chancellor's Office made the directive. CSUB officials also added that a new date for the ceremony has not been identified, but they said it will not be happening this spring. Restaurants have been forced to close their dining rooms because of COVID-19 and hope those services will be enough to keep them afloat. The National Restaurant Association says it's too soon to tell how many people will lose their jobs. It's talking to members of Congress this week about possible aid for workers. Meanwhile, Uber Eats is waiving delivery fees in an effort to get more customers to place orders. The CDC says currently there's no evidence that COVID-19 can be transmitted through food. And we are tracking the chance for isolated thunderstorms and showers to move across the valley this evening and even tracking a winter weather advisory in the mountains until 9 p.m. tonight. So the potential for icy roads down to 3,000 feet and anywhere from a dusting up to 2 to 4 inches of snow above 4,000 feet. Again, this system will be clearing by the evening hours. So you can expect dry conditions for your Wednesday. Temperatures in those upper 50s, maybe low 60s here in the valley for the first day of spring on Thursday, tracking a 10% chance for some very light showers and dry for the first half of the weekend and yet another system moves through by early next week it's going to be very similar to the system that we felt yesterday that's your latest news and weather update for the latest news anytime be sure to log on to our website turn to 23.com